We are here with Navy water polo head coach Mike Schofield. Coach, you're about uh, two weeks into the season and the preseason training. How's it gone so far? Uh, I think fairly well, Chris. Uh, we had a two-week training trip in California last week in July, first week in August. And everybody came out of that healthy. We got a lot of good competition and practicing in. Uh, since they've been back, guys have been doing a fairly good job trying to integrate uh, 14 plebes into the program. But uh, I think things are moving along pretty well so far. Um, how have the seniors done so far getting this team ready to go and the upperclassmen in general? I would say a work in progress. Uh, our seniors generally have a little bit of a weak resume in terms of accomplishment since they've been here. And you know, they're all still here. They're all still in the program, but they've got some They've got some show me to do, um, not only to the coaching staff, but to their own teammates. And, and in terms of assuming some of the leadership roles and the stewardship of their, their younger teammates. Uh, work in progress. You mentioned the 14 freshmen. How have they done getting acclimated to the college game? Uh, I think they've done a nice job. Uh, I give Andy Jarrett, who was in charge of Plebe Summer, and his staff of uh, Plebe Summer a lot of credit. It seemed to be really smooth. Uh, the plebes had a really uh, consistent summer. They showed up for intramurals, had a great attitude, and uh, they're the least of my concerns. They're working hard. They want to be on the team, and uh, they're, they're motivated. You have uh, about five starters and nine letter winners back from last year's team that went 25-7. and seven. What does this team need to improve upon to improve on that record? Uh, honestly, group dynamics and finding a way to play well together. Uh, a lot of coaches will talk about the whole being greater than the sum of the parts. Uh, I think right now, if you uh, look at our parts, we're, we're pretty well stacked with uh, some pretty good talents and guys that can play. Uh, our ability to play well together and sustain it over, you know, I ideally four quarters is uh, unproven at this point. So we need to we need to learn how to fit the pieces together, and, and obviously that's that starts with me and our staff, and uh, that's what we're working on trying to do. What would you consider the strengths of this year's team? Uh, we are we're fast. Uh, we have some guys that don't really need a lot of coaching in terms of scoring goals and, and putting points up on the board. Uh, our defensive mindset is not something that comes real naturally to a number of our players. And again, that, that team cohesion, that, that uh, whole being greater, greater than the sum of the parts, that's something we really need to work on. You've lost in the Eastern Finals the last two years now. Does that serve as any motivation for this year's team, or should it? Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. All right. Uh, last thing, what would make this season a success in your eyes? I think to, to see our seniors grow into their the roles that you would expect of a senior at the Naval Academy, and to have the product in the pool reflect that that's occurred. Uh, you know, and again, uh, playing well as a team and, and you know, up to our potential is not a little bit beyond that. All right, Coach. Thanks for your time. Thanks, Chris.